आईटेप आईटेप कोर्सेस इन जो है मेघालय नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न ये ही यूनिवर्सिटी सीलांग मेघालय गोइंग टू स्टार्ट आईटेप में फोर ईयर बीएड द बीए इंक्लूडेड जो है बीएड कोर्सेस फॉर द जो है मेघालय स्टूडेंट एंड आल ऑफ यू आर वेल अवेयर अबाउट द टीचर्स एजुकेशन इज ए वाइटल इन क्रिएटिंग ए पूल ऑफ स्कूल टीचर्स दैट विल सेव द सेव द जो है नेक्स्ट जनरेशन टीचर्स टीचर प्रिपरेशन इज एन एक्टिविटी दैट रिक्वायर्स मल्टी डिसिप्लिन प्रोस्पेक्टिव एंड नॉलेज फॉर्मेशन ऑफ दी पोजिशन एंड वैल्यूज एंड द डेवलपमेंट ऑफ प्रैक्टिस अंडर द जो है बेस्ट मेंटल टीचर्स मस्ट भी जो है ग्राउंडेड इन इंडियन वैल्यूज लैंग्वेजेस नॉलेज इथोस एंड ट्रेडिशन इंक्लूडिंग द जो है ट्राइबल ट्रेडिशन ऑफ द स्टेट वाई आल्सो जो है बी वेल वर्स्ड इन द लेटेस्ट एडवांस इन एजुकेशन एंड पेडोलॉजी तो नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न हिल यूनिवर्सिटी गोइंग टू स्टार्ट जो है ए न्यू कोर्स इन द जो है कमिंग एकेडमिक ईयर दैट इज ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फाइव The minimum requirement for this course is intermediate, and this is also just like the जो है at par with the जो है NEP 2020, just like NEP 2020. This is uh, also a student centric course. After the first year, student can receive. So he can receive the or she can receive the certificate course. After second year. हाउसो चार्ज द एग्जिट फ्रॉम द कोर्सेज रिसीव द जो है डिप्लोमा कोर्सेज थर्ड ईयर ही कैन जो है अगेन जो है एग्जिट फ्रॉम द कोर्सेज ही कैन रिसीव द जो है डिग्री बट आफ्टर फोर्थ ईयर जो है इवन फोर्थ ईयर डिग्री जो है इम्बेडेड बी एड कोर्स तो दिस इज द मेन ऑब्जेक्टिव ऑफ द दिस कोर्स टू फैसिलिटेट आवर स्टूडेंट्स एंड रिड्यूस द ग्रोथ क्रॉस इन्वॉल्वमेंट रेशियो इन द जो है स्टेट एंड विद दिस वे ने इज गोइंग टू प्रोवाइड ए बेटर बेटर फुल्ली जो है टेन टीचर फॉर टीचिंग इन आवर स्टेट अलॉन्ग विद द अदर पार्ट ऑफ द कंट्री Thank you so much. Um, sir has already given an introduction of the ITEP. Now the full form of ITEP <coughs> is Integrated Teacher Education Program, and this is a four-year course. So eligibility criteria is class twelve. So only after you pass, uh, can a student passes class twelve only they can enter for this course, just like engineering and medical colleges. So it's a four-year full-time course. And Nehu is offering this course just like any other listed organizations under NCTE. So Nehu has recently got the permission to start this course, and we are very, very happy that many students now will get the opportunity to come to Nehu and get a, a very quality education to become good teachers in the future. Because as per NEP 2020, in by by 2030 there will be no more teacher education, uh, you know, programs. There will be only the ITEL, and of course those who are running successfully, like the one year BA program, you know, they will be running. But then only those teachers who pass from this four year uh, ITEL, they will be appointed as teachers in the institutes, in the schools. Okay, so therefore, I want to say regarding the duration, the structure of this course, at in Nehu at the moment now uh, we are offering the secondary level. <coughs> okay, usually yeah. I T E L has four uh, variants. It has the preparatory, the foundation, the middle, and the secondary. So we have got the permission to start the secondary level, and not the other three. And so we have we have the number of teachers here who are well qualified in Nehu itself in both the campuses. We also have the other teachers who are also there willing to be a part of us. Okay, and uh, now why the secondary level? I will just like I would just like to tell you that this secondary stage includes class 
9, 10, 11 and 12. Okay, and in this uh, four years course, you will see class 9 and 10 students, they will engage with curricular areas to ensure the breadth of the study because they are already coming well prepared from the middle stage. So now they are coming to the secondary stage, they are quite experienced and therefore their curriculum will include three languages, okay, arts, education, physical education, vocational education, social sciences and humanities, interdisciplinary areas, mathematics and computational thinking and sciences. So they are going to be specialized in those and classes 11 and 12, in class 11 and 12 more subject choices will be there. Once they pass that and they, they, for students who pass from 11 and 12 more subject choices will be there in this program. So the different curricular areas will be again languages, art education, physical education, vocational education, social sciences and humanities and also just like the 9 and 10, interdisciplinary and also computational thinking. Okay, now the students will have the options to choose subjects here now. So because of the MDC, the multidisciplinary courses, they will have options to choose. So now they can, suppose for instance, they want to uh, opt for mathematics, they will also have an additional uh, 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 they can also opt for advanced mathematics. So mathematics will also be there and they can also opt for advanced mathematics. So they can become a full-fledged mathematics teacher uh, with this degree. Okay, and then um, this entire ITEL course, again they are running into credit hours. So they have to complete 160 credits to get this degree. Okay, and NCT has given us uh, an option to the universities that you can also add 30% or more of your courses. So 176 is the total. So out of, uh, we, you cannot cross 176. 160 is the requirement, but we as a university, we can add more till 176. Okay, and the intake now, I would just like to talk about the intake. Uh, we are having fifth we have been we are offering BA, BA and BSc, BA. So BA, BA is 50 students and BSc, BA is 50 students. And uh, the main idea here, here is uh, every batch we will be having 100 students coming into the university and they will be progressing to second semester, third semester, fourth semester and it will go on till the last semester, that is the eighth semester. Okay, and the main objective I would just like to uh, add that why we require this sir has mentioned just now, the most important point here is that to have quality teaching. So that when they go back and teach in schools, we will, the children will be very, very, really, you know, blessed to have very good quality teachers in different disciplines like physics, chemistry, maths, then history, geography, education, then we, we, and we also have Khasi as a language. This time we have also managed to put Khasi and Garo as a language uh, so that our students from here, they can opt that as a language paper. And um, again, uh, I would just like to say that this one, it seeks to ensure that prospective teachers are given highest quality education in content, pedagogy, values, and also practice. So internship is also very important here. And uh, the internship program will start from fifth semester and it will go on till the seventh semester. So that is 20 credits is given for school internship where you know as the students who are coming here to study in Nehu, they will be having good opportunity to go to different schools which will be registered with us, with the university and they will be having a very good uh, background of internship program. Okay, and um, another one is that the basic uh, requirement is how they will enter the item. So in the Nehu website you will see that they have already put the ITEP, uh, you know, uh, the NTA portal, they have given us a link and a page to share in the Nehu website, which we have shared. And the last date is 30th of April. The students will have to go to that link and they have to open the page, register themselves in the portal. And then after registering, they have to pay a minimum fee of 650 rupees for SCST students. And the rest are like 1,000 rupees. And after that, uh, the requirement is they need to have 50% marks 
in class 12. Class 12, class 12 to register for this program. Then once <coughs> they have done that, then the NSET will give them a date for examination, just like CUET. So then they sit for the NSET examination. Then after that examination is over, then NCTE will send us the scores of the students to the different different universities. There is a list of universities you will see from all India. So I think we are number 62. Nehu is number 62 in the list. So if you opt for Nehu, then obviously NCT will send the scores to Nehu. Then after that, Nehu will sit down. We have our own regulations. Nehu has our, our own regulation. We will impose that regulation with that NCT score, and based on that, the Gomasaya, Meghalaya, SDST, we have reserve categories. We have physically challenged. We have all those categories, which is specifically for Nehu only. We will add those along with the NSET scores, and then the total score will be given, and based on that, the candidates will be selected in the university. So the registration program, BSc period and BA period, it's a dual major bachelor degree, right? After completion of this course, the pass out students will be eligible. For teaching at secondary as well as higher secondary, which is up to class level. Earlier, what we said, PGT and PGT. Another benefit of the students that after completion of this program or course, the students, the passer students, are also. Will be eligible to take admission in one year PG program as well as two year PG program. For example, those students will exit the course at three year. They are eligible. They are entitled to take admission in two year PG program as per NEP 2020. And other students those who will pass four year program, IT program. They will be eligible for one year PG program. As well as they can also register for the program of PhD as per new guideline of NEP and UGC. So, prospectives or benefits of the pass out students are very good than the other traditional courses. It's a course of integration. Not a joint program. Both disciplinary subjects, interdisciplinary subjects, as well as content of pedagogy subjects will be integrated from one year to four year. Simultaneously, both they will gain content knowledge, contextual knowledge, pedagogical knowledge, research skill, and all other co-curricular and curricular activities also. That's why the Ministry of Education, Government of India, designed such an innovative teacher training program that our university and Department of Education introduced this year. It will be beneficial, beneficial for students of Meghalaya as well as nearer state of the Meghalaya also, and it will be a major contribution of our university. For the country also. If you have any doubt, you may ask questions. The answer is also coming from NTA. So university does not have a hand in this. It is totally with the Ministry of Education, where they have formatted and done everything. They were working on this for quite some time. For like one year, they were working on it, and finally, they have come up now for the first time for teacher training. We are having a separate type of a national level entrance test. So university does not have any role here. Only after they pass from there, they come to us. Then we take them over. Just like the same. Still so you can do your PG in your major subjects. This is for zoology. Then you can do your PG in zoology with this degree. It's not necessary that you will become an MA. You have to do or I have no chance. I'll just become a teacher now. Nothing like that. After this four years, you only have a teacher degree plus your major degree. Yeah, the BA, 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 B